Why are they showing me this? Definitely sucks. What is this music? Nah, niggas about the dick suck. Vampire ass house. Oh, brother. Here go to chat. Well, why isn't there a house right there? It looks like empty enough space. There should be a house right there, pre. Niggas saying poverty. You couldn't even afford to step on the property of one of these, but what, what are you talking about? All right, bro. It was literally filmed two years ago, dude. Like, it don't even look like that no more. <clears throat> Why are you slow panning into the house? Just keep driving. Why is he doing that? All right, bro. Niggas talking to me about poverty. This shit literally look like a castle. All right, bro. It's creative though. Like how many, like how many, like instead of a lawn, you have a driveway that you can curve. It got a curve in it. I know y'all bit y'all weird ass whores like curves and shit like that. It's got a curve in it and also a full drive through all the way up. What a garage. Nigga said dirt Troit, get banned. Hold on, stop moving. Like I don't even know why niggas are why are you playing? Like what is that? What is that? Look at how full, hold on. Look at how full this garden is. Look at the color. Even without the winter time, it's still like, it's like it's doing its own little thing. Another curve. Very well maintained property, like slash lawn service. Look at this house. Y'all, like, you literally can't even hate on this. I literally was in there. Y'all can't even hate on that. Like, green grass, luscious. It's a tree in front. It's lonely as hell. It's got a driveway up through the thing. That's that's fire. Like, what are you talking about? Pre-civil rights architecture goes hard. What were you doing there? Vibing. How was the vibe off? Look at this. Hooping, hoop dreams, hoop dreams, right here. Eat light work. See how each house got its own little personality and it don't look like there is all, yo, you're actually weird as fuck. You're weird as fuck. Cause her name wasn't Ashley. Ashley was just the name that slipped out at the time of me telling that story. Her name wasn't Ashley either since you think you know shit. you don't invite certain people to certain areas because like y'all really just don't know this looks like hotel transylvania okay bro like people want to go here no you niggas can't afford to come here what are you talking about zero melanin count are you fucking serious are you dumb are you stupid 
Are you stupid? Do y'all know how many black people own play? Okay, you know what? It's it's okay because like I forgot I'm talking to a whitewashed racist chat that don't like to see black people persevere or thrive in any context unless they're a rapper or an entertainer in some fashion. Y'all don't even know what niggas is doing to attain this level of wealth. You don't even know. Like it is what it is, bro. I'm cooling. I'm, I'm I'm relaxing, bro. Niggas not and they they not built like how I'm built. They not from where I'm from, and I, I should just be open and honest and accept that fact. It's a very mundane fact. These houses got personalities. They they're, they're homes to people. You know what I'm saying? They're not those like L.A. Uh, Miami ass homes that are for whores. You know what I'm saying? They got like bitches running in and out. You know what I'm saying? Every day, and you got a thousand roommates. You know what I'm saying? Like, like it's not built like that. These are homes. These are like families live here, and people of like prominence and like culture and like you know respectable individuals and shit like that. Here y'all come trying to like stink up the atmosphere and shit. I'm just saying. I'm just. I'm just putting it out there. I'm just putting it out there. I'm just putting it out there. They don't do drugs. They don't do drugs. On the contrary, my friend, if you knew anything, you would know they don't do drugs. Why the sky depressing? I don't know. It's fucking snowing. Exactly. They don't want unique homes no more. Everybody want to. Everybody want a square that's modernized on the inside with no personality. Y'all don't know shit. Y'all don't know shit. Where's the snow? It's a rain snow mix. It's a rain snow mix. If you were here on this day two years ago, you would know that. Stop asking questions. Look at this. Y'all don't understand. Especially in the fall, like places like this shine crazy. Look at the brickwork. You don't understand it. You don't understand it. And I got, and I understand that you don't understand it. It is what it is. It's not the same house. It's not the same. L listen to the ASMR rain. Hitting the dash as he's driving. Look at this. That's just fi that's just fire right there. Like you don't get it. Nineties movies type neighborhood. This is just what do you what what does that even mean? Not gonna lie, I like these houses. That's what I'm saying. Say it with your stand on it. Don't be afraid to let niggas know how you really feel about shit. These are comp like like you could really put your foot in these like take your shoes off and walk around and okay he introduced some music he introduced some music let me turn that down boy slow down with all that yeah but like like I understand this is good oh yeah he tried beating it it's cool the killer is in one of those homes um I actually that's not true look at that look at that. But niggas are they're cock sucking because they don't know what the interior looks like. Even that even the exterior look cool enough. But they're they're cock riding, so this is what they're doing. It's all good. Now it's a Count Dracula ass home. You will be lucky to live in that garage talking about Count Dracula. Alright, bro. So show us. I don't have like the intricate I don't know every person that like the ownership changes throughout the year. Some people give it to their kids, their nephews, their nieces, their best friends when they like some people are house sitting. You don't got access to everything everywhere all at once. You don't. So I don't even know why you're asking me that. Notice nobody in the outside. They're not outside because they're enjoying the home that they paid for, dumbass. Why would I be outside and I got a multi-million dollar house that I paid for and I could comfortably live in and get everything from? What are you talking about? Why would I be outside? It's 70 degrees. It's, it's what, like negative 72 degrees outside right now? You talking about why niggas aren't outside? Really? Okay. And we just saw like three people outside maintaining their yard. Obviously, it's like probably eight, nine in the morning. Niggas are at work or at school. And some of them who are at, at home are probably sick. You know what I'm saying? Easy as fuck to eat, like understand and ascertain the situation that's happening right now. Yeah, y'all don't get it. Y'all don't understand. It's all good, though. Why are you saying that? Gravity Falls ass house. Okay, weird loser. Who watches Gravity Falls? I want to start watching it, but after you commented, like, I probably won't watch it now. They look empty. They're clearly occupied. Dick sucking again. Look at that. Look at the grass. Look at the greenery. This nigga's watching you from every angle. You can't even come through this neighborhood without getting watched. 
What are we talking about? I don't get y'all. I, I get. I understand. I understand. Niggas is brainwashed. They paying three thousand dollars a month for a five hundred square foot apartment and to come in here dick sucking, talking about like, oh yeah, that look like this, that look like that. Like, nigga, what do you look like? You look like a fucking idiot. Move from your state. What are you talking about? What are you doing? Shit, crazy. How is kind of cool? I know, like they're they're be they're better than cool. Whoa, what the fuck? Wait, 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 wait. We going down the wrong end. Chill, just chill, just chill. The other shit was unrelated to the housing market. The other shit was unrelated to the housing market. Got nothing to do with me. Got nothing to do with the creator of the video. Just putting that out there. Look up LA housing. It ain't gonna be much. But watch niggas be like, oh nah, this shit, this the this the modern wave. This the new shit. This is that's not my recommendations. Like I just told y'all before. What the fuck? I just told y'all before, I never clicked on nothing for Detroit related for this, even for the situation either. And then they randomly gave this to me. But all of a sudden, I'm horn. Okay, let me go back. Let me go back to show you even what it was. Because, like, this is what niggas is doing. That's it. What does that say? No, no, no. Because y'all not about to play with me like this. Like, what does that say? That says city tour downtown Detroit. Lit vibes, nightlife. Who made the video? I don't know. Caught Sada Baby mob in downtown. First of all, I've never seen Sada Baby in downtown Detroit. I've been there like at least every day, like period, whatever. I didn't see, bro. Um, that th this is literally he's doing a tour. I'm not watching it. I don't want this in my recommended. I don't have. This is probably mad long ago, bro. Like there, we don't even. I don't even think he's, like, you got to go at the at, like at a certain. Exactly, but niggas want me to look up L.A. homes for what? Let me look up L.A. homes. <laughs> more like LA homeless. <laughs> you get what I'm saying? You feel what you feel what I'm saying? Like more like LA homeless cuz like them like Look, they're not even they're not even showing me never speak down on the town the fuck how many people in your life have you known to call la the town the town for la hell i don't know bro it's not even a town it's clearly a city clearly a city the town imagine imagine the town. The town. Oh my god! Like, what are we? What are we doing? Can I get like a realistic portrayal of the average LA home, or am I gonna keep seeing this propaganda where they're showing me two point four million dollar homes? Like, this is not how it is at base. Show me level one entry level homes in in LA. They show they trying to show me the best of the best. I'm not paying seventy million to live in LA. I'm not. You're very LA coded, Aaliyah. I'm about to ban you. tents where where is it show my screen i i'm literally showing my screen what are you talking about i'm not going i'm never going to stop taking the shit on you what are you talking about you sound like it no i don't bro no i don't now you now you chat it now you chat it now you chat it let us see the video i'm going to click a video that is based off of reality and not the best of the best because i want a realistic portrayal of what i could expect if i walk into la as a region as a society breaks it down five most common la homes all right show me black man i'm valerie gustin and i've been an architect in los angeles for over 20 years today i'm going to break down architectural details of some of the most popular housing styles in los angeles from some of the earliest built structures in look at this shit Niggas talking about Detroit. Look at this shit. All right. California. It's a type of house that most people dream about when they think about living in Los Angeles that offers these amazing views to the Pacific Ocean. I saw this on an episode of... um. I forgot that show with, like, the four white brothers and then the, the, the cousin that came in to live with them after his mama died. And then we found out that one of the brothers was actually fucking the mom and his uncle happened to be his father, but he died before he could figure it out fully or before he knew before they could reconcile and then it was his girl. i don't remember like i forgot what the name of the show was but i forgot um 
Come on, somebody knows the name of the show. Oh my god, bro. Now nah, niggas are trying to act like I don't know what I'm talking about. It's literally a show. One of the niggas on there was gay. He had an old white lady leading the pack. It was a crime fact. Animal! Animal Kingdom! Animal Kingdom. Animal Kingdom. It's not made up. It's not made up. Animal Kingdom. That is literally what it's called. Thank you. For once. Somebody with some brains. Never seen that? Go watch it. Don't do that, actually. First up, the dingbat. Ha, ah, dingbat ass house. Oh, my fault. This looked bad. Typically a six to 12 unit apartment building. Damn, y'all, all right, I didn't even mean to laugh. The front of the building is elevated to allow cars to park. Another thing that you'll- This look crazy. Notice about the dingbat is that it's a box. It's all about efficiency and filling the lot to maximize the number of units. Maximize the killing efficiency. I can fit on a piece of property. Now I wasn't laughing because it's not funny now that I look at it. Dingbat. Like, unironically, it looked crazy. Apartments really define neighborhoods all over Los Angeles. They right. can be found pretty readily all over the San Fernando Valley, West Los Angeles, and neighborhoods like Culver City. Imagine an earthquake happened, though, and it just ruined this whole shit. Like, how do you recover from this? Palms. So why is it called a dingbat? The term why? dingbat comes from typography. It's a symbol that's not a letter or a number. Many of your dingbat buildings featured a name or had a symbol on the front, a way to sort of decorate. Yeah, it looked like a gentleman's club. I don't know why I didn't just say strip club, but like the pink flamingo. You mean to tell me you can't just go in there and get a dance from some these flat banal facades. The construction of dingbat apartments really exploded in the post-war boom of the 50s and 60s in Los Angeles when many people were moving for jobs. Mm. What better way to give some sort of character to a building that essentially had none than to provide some sort of symbols or right. some sort of fun, playful elements on the front of the building to make people feel a little bit more excited about. Motherfuckers acting like they ain't never seen old homes I'm fucking dead. Oh, but you weren't given this type of energy when it came to defending Detroit, but now you want to do it for LA? I see exactly what's going on here. Their home. Don't let her switch the narrative chat. These old as fuck. Here's how to spot a dingbat in the wild. First off, it's essentially a big box. The ground floor space is then cannibalized to allow parking for cars. Let me get inside. Oh. And you can see that they've got this dingbat symbol of a flamingo. What you've also got is a full width curb cut that runs the full face of the building. And so the entire width of the lot is given over as essentially a driveway. Now, as someone who's almost been hit by somebody backing out of their dingbat apartment, I can tell you dingbat apartments. That sounds racist, bro. The way you keep saying it, like you could just say apartment small motel small living arrangement why do you keep saying dingbat in front of it i don't know I don't, i'm not getting the best vibe off bro like show me the inside of the house or just shut the fuck up at this point everybody got dish network oh my god y'all in la going through it i'm so sorry dude i'm really sorry i ain't even mean to be on that type of time with y'all i'm sorry y'all having dish network and direct tv as your only cable source holy fuck apartments really are quintessentially la it's something that makes them home below court in la or nah you know you're doing bad when you got dish or or, or direct tv like some I, like i feel like you think like i remember i convinced myself at one point when i went somewhere that was direct tv oriented i was like you know what it's really not that bad but then the more and more i was using the remote i was like this shit look crazy as fuck i'm sorry it's just not even a bad combination it's just the remote ugly as hell and then the dish network remote same thing ugly as fuck no on-demand button original similar to the dingbat but i remember the first time the cable went out and it was just a little windy that day after having dish network for like a month and i'm like nah i can't do this i'm about to have to start slinging at this point i was thinking that at nine years old like we can't really we can't do this this is crazy this is crazy like this is this ain't this ain't gonna work, man. I'll do whatever you gotta do. It is just it is what it is, man. The low courts are trying to solve LA's. It was it was barely windy. It was like the wind the wind for that day was probably forty miles per hour. Shit was gone the whole day. Affordable housing problem, but in a different way. Whereas the dingbat apartment stacked and maximized the property for a maximum number of units, bungalow court apartments offered a taste of single family residential living for working class people who couldn't afford a single family house. The bungalow court apartment really prioritizes. That's cute, bro. But unless you're going to show me the inside of this, you can shut the fuck up real. OK, he didn't show me anything. I thought he was going to take me on a tour inside each one of these establishments and then, you know, show me on a periodic table 
how worthless I am for even trying to, you know, come up in his te- in his territory. But he didn't show me anything. He just insulted dingbats for like for like 10 minutes. And I don't like that. It wasn't too educational. I don't I want like a, a visual representation, an example of the inside of the home, too, though. You know what I mean? 